So now in this video we have an inverting comparator. We set our reference voltage to half the supply voltage, uh, 2.5 volts. Our uh, trim pod here is our signal voltage. It is uh, 5 volts and uh, the output's low. If we lower the voltage below 2.5 volts, now we're at 0 volts, the output is high right there. So the output is inverted from what our signal is when it comes to being higher or lower than our reference voltage. And here is our schematic diagram. So of course you always have to power the op amp and uh, positive supply pin 8, negative supply pin 4 using the LM358. They don't always show that on the schematic. For the inverting comparator right there, our reference voltage is going to the non-inverting input. And so we use two 10K resistors to get half of the supply voltage uh, right there. You notice that it's higher on the schematic. Sometimes it may be lower on the schematic. And um, you got to pay close attention to which side is plus and minus. On the uh, physical component there, the plus is below the minus. So now that we got our reference voltage, our signal is going to the inverting input or the minus uh, right there. And so the uh, output always wants to be more like what the plus is than what the minus is. That's the main takeaway. So if we are above 2.5 volts with our uh, trim pot, because we got uh, the full supply voltage across it, if we go up above halfway, that's a higher voltage than we got there. So we end up with a low output. The blue LED lights up. Whereas if we drop below 2.5 volts, because that's the voltage that we set, then it'll be lower, which means we'll have a high output. And uh, you don't get quite 5 volts, maybe 4, but the red LED will light up. And here is a close-up of the circuit. So positive supply to pin uh, 8 up there, negative supply to pin 4. As we said before, our reference voltage is at the plus or the non-inverting input and a 10k from the negative supply, 10k from the positive supply. Since they're equal value there, you'll get half the resistance. And then our uh, signal voltage right there. We got the trim pot, 10k trim pot, doesn't matter its value really. Um, but uh, any case, 5 volts across it. So if you set it uh, halfway, that'll be about 2.5 volts. So you can see about halfway there is where the output changes. But now we got a lower voltage, and uh, so we must have a positive 5 volts. The uh, output is the top in there. Coming to the jumper, more positive red LED lights up right there. Make sure it's forward bias. Lower value resistor than for the blue LED because red LEDs just don't get uh, as bright. If we go up in voltage higher than uh, 2.5 volts, now we have a low output. Again, it's inverted. So it uh, connects to ground uh, really well. But you can see the 1K resistor from the positive supply, long lead anode, short lead to cathode, and it uh, heads to ground. 